And now moving on to a mishap of epic proportions. Believe it or not, in January of 1961, the United States almost nuked itself. According to a recently unclassified document obtained by The Guardian, the U.S. Air Force was dramatically close to dropping a pair of hydrogen bombs over Goldsboro, North Carolina. The report reveals that the bombs each carried a four megaton payload, making them 260 times more powerful than the atomic bombs dropped on Hiroshima and Nagasaki during World War II. According to the documents, the two atomic bombs were released after a B-52 plane carrying them went into a tailspin during a routine test flight. The bombs fell off the carrier and should have de detonated, but they were spared because of one low-voltage switch that failed to activate properly. And that small malfunction prevented what would have been the most devastating and widespread nuclear damage in history. These documents were obtained by Guardian journalist Eric Schlosser, who has been researching the nuclear arms race for an upcoming book. Through his research, Schlosser says he's discovered nearly 700 incidents like this that took place between 1950 and 1968, and the public has no idea. He said the U.S. government has consistently tried to withhold information from the American people in order to prevent questions being asked about their nuclear weapons policy. We were told there was no possibility of these weapons accidentally detonating. But thanks to Schlosser's research, we now know that's not the case.